Hey, what's up? I'm Spencer with Movements. Uh, I'm going to take a second to show you uh, the gear that I brought with me for this little run. For the kit here, the Toms and Kick, um, this, is, uh, this was my first uh, custom kit. Um, I've had it for the past like 10 or 11 years, but I've done a ton of work on it. I stripped off the finish, had it wrapped in walnut, uh, stained, clear coated it, um, redid all the edges, cut the kick drum down from like a crazy 19 inch depth to a 13 inch depth. It's just like your standard sort of Keller six ply maple shells that a lot of custom companies are using these days. Um, but uh, it's got a lot of sentimental value to me. So I'm glad that I could uh, uh, bring this one on this little string of holiday shows. So starting with uh, the kick and toms, we've got a, a eight by 12, a 14 by 15 and a 13 by um, 22. For the snare drum, this one is a special one. Um, so I put this drum together uh, from parts of two companies. Um, one of them formerly known as Whack Drums, currently known as Spinelli Drums. Uh, they do these free floating lugs um, and all their drums have uh, nothing bolted to them. The only hole that you'll see is just for the air vent. Um, and then of course the shell here is a seamless brass made by Blackwood Drums. Um, they're an amazing drum company. They do everything. Um, you could get a ply shell drum, you could get a stave shell drum, you could get a metal kit if you wanted to. Um, big, big selection. Uh, highly recommended. Love them. For cymbals, um, all Sabian. Um, I love Sabian. Right now I'm playing the HHX Complex series. We've got a 20 inch uh, HHX Complex Thin Crash and then a 22 inch version of the same thing over here. Uh, as for hi-hats, uh, this is kind of an odd pair, but I, I love it. Um, this is a 16 inch pair. Um, it's got a, I've got a 16 inch HHX Complex medium hat bottom on the top and then a 16 inch HH Thin Crash on the bottom. And um, for some reason, it just works really, really well. It, it's, it's a big set of hats, but it's also like really articulate um, and easy to manage. Uh, you wouldn't think so because they're so big, but you know, that's just kind of been my thing. I got all about the 16 inch hats. And then we've got a uh, little tambourine there. Some of the songs require that. So I've kind of just integrated that into the setup and uh, DW9000. Um, let's see what else. All uh, Yamaha hardware. Yamaha makes the best hardware in my opinion. So um, yeah, it's amazing. For sticks, I'm using uh, Promark 5B forwards. Um, they're uh, just a little bit heavier in the front than your typical 5B sticks. Um, I just really like that feel. So that's kind of always been my thing. Um, as far as heads go, uh, I'm doing something a little bit different this time, but I usually run just like a standard like G1 coated uh, on the snare with an Evans 300 on the bottom. Uh, clear G2s over clear G1s for the toms and then a uh, clear EQ4 with a coated EQ3 in the front. I'm Spencer with Movements. Uh, this has been my gear rundown. Thank you for watching.